Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode in the realm. I am here just in time for early sunrise. And I am joined by Justice Bella, wherever she might be. The building. <laughs> that works. Uh, anyway, we've had a very productive couple episodes. In the last one, we finished building the ice cream shop. And <clears throat> Hello, Barnaby. I think I'll take you today, because you're right here. Anyway, we're building something brand new today. We're gonna, uh, well, this is gonna be a multi-episode long project, but we're gonna be starting to build a clock tower. And, you know, uh, we haven't done too much to the ice cream shop since we last, uh, were here. But I'll just jump in really quick. Give you an idea. Oh no, Barnaby, please don't come down here. I just added a little <laughs> icicle on the bottom. Okay. Um, hello. I'll be up in a minute. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Anyway, uh, this isn't going to be too long of a project. Barnaby, where are you? That's not a good sign. <laughs> Oh, that's really not a good sign. Uh, okay, I'm gonna have to go find it. I'll cut the video and I'll be right back. Okay, everybody, we're back. I have good news. I found Barnaby. It turns out he went into the Nether because uh, you might hear this periodically. There's another portal in this house's basement, and uh, when he teleported to me, he landed in there. So it wasn't that bad. I just had to go and get him out. Uh, anyway. Let's get started with today's festivities, shall we? So, in here, we've got a very interesting design on our hands today. What I'm gonna do, grab like a stack of uh, stone and smooth stone. And we're gonna be alternating, like on each corner, we're gonna be alternating with a uh, like stone, smooth stone. No stone, stone. I mean, this side's gonna be a little different. And also, um, let's make some stone bricks while we're here, because we're gonna need those too. So take like another stack of of regular stone, and don't craft it. Just use the stone cutter and put it in there. The front side's gonna be a little different than the rest of the building, just because this is where the door's gonna go. So, like, the door is going to be right here. But for the rest of it, it will follow the same pattern. So, while you're figuring out how to use the stone cutter, I'm going to do this. <laughs> it's not that. So, with the exception of the front, can you, like, come around and help me, um, fill in with the stone? I think this is the, uh, move. Oh. I got it. There's gonna be a lot of that today, I can feel it. Oops. <laughs> uh, that's not good. Okay, I need to get my other pickaxe out. I need to make a better silk touch pickaxe. So anyway, uh, what we're gonna do now, we're gonna like go over all of it. We're gonna like do one full layer around here with uh, stone bricks minus the doorway. Like so, it's gonna come up to here. Like the doorway is gonna be a bit different. I'm gonna make it like that, but the rest of it's gonna follow the same pattern. So let's just do like one layer of this. And then on the sides and the back, build up the corners. Oh. I got it. And I'll teleport you up here so you don't um, have to 
I climb back oh. up. Don't move. <laughs> so anyway, what we're gonna do up here, on each corner, I'm gonna put one of these. I have wool, so I'm what I'm gonna be doing, I'm gonna fill that in. Uh, but for the rest of it, I actually want you to add on two. Like, add on one to each of these corners, and then start bringing it around, like, on over top of where the wool's gonna go. Like this. So I just follow behind me as I do this when I catch up to you. Oh, there's a sheep in there. Hello, Mr. Sheep. Do I fill in that bit? Yeah, that's fine. I ran out of stone bricks. Do you have any left? I've got 12. Okay, that might not be enough for the rest of this, so I'll make a few more. How many are no. left? How many, how many do we need to do? Like, um, let me count that. 2, 4, 6, 8. I can make 8. Really? <laughs> okay. So we've got that part done. Now we're going to do a little mo more of what we did at the beginning. Uh, I'm going to come over here. Grab a couple of these to get up top. We're going to come back up top, do our um, smooth stone again. And a regular stone in the same pattern as we did below. Oh, I am craving, I am craving a burger right now. <laughs> Specifically. The one I named after myself. So I'll be right there in a second. I'm going to teleport up to you. And before I do that, I'm going to get some more stone bricks out because I'm going to need to use these pretty soon. That should do it. Actually, let's think here. One, two, three, four. Eight plus seven is fifteen on each side. That's not enough. Okay. Um Let me think of how I'm gonna do this here. I think what we'll do I'm gonna tell Port up to you, and then you drop down to the chest. Okay, um, can you hop down to the chest, and I'll teleport you back up when you're ready. Uh, can you get some stone? Just some, I'll, I'll do the rest, the other part of this. How much so, anyway, stone should I get two? Yeah, I'd probably get two stacks, just to be safe. Okay. So what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be layering this, I'm going to be putting a regular stone on top of each smooth stone, and then between those... Um, if you could actually start by doing the rest of the stone, I'm going to be um, alternating with these um, stone brick stairs I made. And this is the, you know, the part of the clock where it's like, going to start to like go up. Because the bottom part is going to be like the, you know, the base, and this is also where I'm going to have a shop. Most of the clock, though, is going to be just like it's like its neck, if that makes sense. And then it'll, and the hard part I think will be when we get up towards the top, how I'm gonna do the part where it comes back out. I've never really been good at building in that shape. <laughs> this part's fine. So when we get farther up towards like the head of the clock. Actually, what are we gonna what are we gonna do next? Uh oh, 
Something just shot me. No skeletons. Yeah, I was trying. Oh. <laughs> I forgot to teleport you up, didn't I? <laughs> oh! Not today. Goodbye, skeleton. <laughs> um. How am I gonna do this? That did not work. Oh, hello. Oh, that's why it didn't work. Okay. So now I'm back up here. Could you... Do you have a shovel on you? No. Alright, can you take the shovel and start digging out the ground? I want that back, though. Also, um, yeah. get, the, get all the white wool out of the chest and start... Um, you don't need to dig out all of the floor, like, before... Wait, come back really quick. Because, um... We're gonna end up building the walls in, so like to start you out, like you're gonna just end up digging out like around the outside. So like, yeah, I'll break out the corners, like so like you don't wanna. You can leave this row of grass on the outside because we like need to build walls over here. Okay. But like you get the idea, right? I don't need to do a fourth corner. Yeah. And the whole floor is going to be white wool. And we'll worry about the walls when we come to it. Oh. I teleported myself up. Do I have this? Enjoy that shovel. <laughs> oh, hello, creeper. Goodbye, creeper. This part's gonna be slow. Actually, I think what I'm gonna do first to make this a little easier to do... I'm gonna build part of the uh, ceiling now. Just so I can like, have something to place all this on. Ooh! I'll deal with that in a second. What's in here? Oh, hello, skeleton. Watch your head. Okay, this should make it a little easier to build the roof. Yeah, that's much better. I got it, I got it. I love how this bow just deletes them instantly. I hear another one somewhere. Uh, uh, it's outside. Oh, I see a creeper down there. Hi. Bye. The sweet sound of zombies not being able to bother me. Alright, this part of the roof is done. So anyway, watch out. Anyway, the um, rest of the inside, I'll start working on the walls. I don't need any more of the wool or these smooth bricks. Alright, 
let's do all this. Make it look nice. Oh, hello, skeleton. You can go away now. <laughs> Could you run out to the chest and get a bunch of stone? We're gonna be um, building it in a layer up here, like... I just did a layer up top. So you see I have it up there? Oh yeah. So I get the at the like farthest up layer. Am I filling the whole thing in? Yeah, in the whole thing. And while you're doing that, I am going to make a bunch of buttons. Oh no! That was not good. Um. Okay, this went here, that went here. Jungle planks don't have. I heard Barnaby got hurt, where is he? You good? Go go away, zombie. Okay, I have grass. I need grass. I forget whose house this is. Whoever's house this is, I'm sorry about that. That's my bad. Uh, hopefully I have enough gates left to fix it. I don't. I know there are two more gates over here. I'll replace that later. I'll fix this path later, too. How did I do the path through this? I forgot what I wanted to do. Okay, I think I'll just do my... I think I'll just get more of the path through that. I'm going to grab the spruce as well. Make a quick crafting table, because I realized I forgot to do that earlier. No, not another one! Oh. <laughs> Where do they keep coming from? Where? <laughs> Oh, oh my god, I should that. Should I put some torches in it? Uh, yeah. But where the hell do these things keep coming from? I have I... no idea. And they don't even make any noise until they're right behind you. Okay, so... I need to fix that. Just trying to make a door. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, that there and there. I have some of the bricks and the wool on me from this. I need two stone bricks here and three pieces of wool. There should be some left, a uh, decent amount left in the chest. Seriously, I don't want to be down here. There's no stone bricks. Make you can make more with the uh, stone cutter. Not there. I put it back down, didn't I? Oh, I didn't put it back oh. down. Um, oh. I have it. <laughs> oh yeah, that got blown up. It's in my inventory. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, um, that maybe that should go. Yeah, I think I should do buttons on every one of these. Alright, two buttons to spare. Oh, not two buttons to spare. I need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I'm in the water again. Okay, that could have gone a bit better. <laughs> But overall, I think this is going to turn out pretty well. Probably, um, I think what we'll do, I'll come back and I'll fix this path. And in the next episode, we'll finish the uh, inside of the shop. And then hopefully we'll get going with the rest of this. But for now, that will be it t for today. I want to thank everyone for watching, and especially those of you that stuck around for the creeper explosion. That was the annoying part. Uh, but for now... Uh, that will be all, and I will see everybody next episode.